We're going to hear about a company that's working on a 100% electric jet ski. So this is Alti. Nice to meet you. Hello, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So tell us a little bit about Viva, what the mission is, and what the goal is here. Well, it all started with, of course, a mission where we wanted to make something, you know, green and, and something that we, we were kind of horrified with, with all traditional ways of, you know, carrying huge containers of, of oil and petrol and then you know you have leaks and spills everywhere so we wanted to kind of create something that is modern is contemporary in that way that uh, uh, it has to be electric and, and uh, of course uh, regarding charging uh, maintenance and, and, and all this we wanted to make it easy and so it's very practical yeah. so, so th there's the side that says more responsible and uh, a little bit more environment friendly and that kind of thing exactly what about the user experience so when I think of a jet ski I think loud buzzing everywhere quite quite annoying to many people yes. in the areas that they end up what are you seeing in this space why is it so exciting uh, well of course that's part of it as well uh, I, there was a there was a case where I was actually uh, with my family on a, on a on a uh, on a lakeside, and there were two old uh, jet skis on the lake going wow wow wow, and I said I really that sound annoys me, and that was actually the start when I contacted Timo and said hey we got to do something about this and let's let's start making an electric jet ski yeah. because it was so annoying, and that's one of our missions is kind of like. We know that people get annoyed because their neighbors or whoever close by has a, has a petrol version and makes a lot of noise. So they are really annoying. So that was one of the missions to get kind of fix that problem, so to say. Yeah. yeah. And, and as a company, are you focusing on the technology side and integrating with, with other jet ski builders or you're actually doing the whole mission yourself and creating the models? in-house uh, um, as, as Viva Jet Skies? Well, yeah, we are kind of forerunners in, in the way that we are trying to, we, we are coming, we are kind of like noticing uh, issues and, and challenges that come with electricity. Yeah. And so there aren't that many partners that we can team up with. We have to find solutions ourselves. Right, yeah. So in that way, we are, we're total forerunners. There are a few other companies that are very close to the same in the same situation as we are they have first versions maybe they have two or so so in that way we don't have of course we have like great companies that are helping us uh, regarding of course the jet uh, the the, uh, the battery the engine and so on but uh, of course I, I mean I want to be honest in the next two years we are going to be facing many many challenges that it's, it's our job to kind of fix and, and find the technical solutions yeah. To, 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 to avoid problems, yeah, yeah. for sure. And um, what kind of market are you seeing demand from? Is it mm. more the super yacht side, the large yacht side, or just people wanting individual jet skis? To, to uh, well, we, we started off with this kind of a thing that probably uh, people who are re like rental companies that they rent right, out, okay. that, that would yeah. be our first mission. But it has, uh, as, as time has passed, let's say like the last five months have been crazy in that way that we see now that we have, we're going to have this kind of a, a pro version which is aimed at, at police uh, rescue uh, personnel right, the, the, the army side exactly right, yeah, yeah. so that's going to be a, uh, uh, one way that we're going right, nice. to but yeah. on, on the other side we also have of course private yacht owners you know who have big ships that they want to have one of these on the, yeah. the back decks yeah, they're cool they're a good toy exactly right. and I like I said in, in Dusseldorf already where I was with the miniature version I said yeah. all the men who want to go to the Monaco uh, a boulangerie to get the you know the croissants in the morning quietly so the wife doesn't wake right, yeah. up this <laughs> is the, the yeah they get thing with the electric <laughs> yeah. so so of yeah. course in this way it, it's not probably the cheapest jet ski on the market but uh so so in that way it would be perfect on those super yachts uh, you know on the, on the back deck yeah okay super thank yeah. you very much for your insight thank you really thank you thank you everybody if you enjoy content like this make sure you're following here to see plenty more of it outside of that i'll see you very soon bye for now